Hello, everybody. It's Princess and the Bear. Obviously. We're here hanging out. We're at Islands of Adventure. They're actually not melting today. I know. We found a nice shady spot. Yes. I can almost see the osprey from here. Oh. Yeah. It's a bird after my own heart. Just keeps on keeping on. I should post this on uh, our things. Yes. Do our stuff and things. Two lights. Wow, y'all are lovely. Hello, everybody. Hey. Who we got in here? We got live chat. Yeah, you should up. be able to turn on your chat. Yeah. There we go. So you can see Just fades too quickly. You need to be able to like adjust it. More options, YouTube. Come on, you're killing us here. Hey, Will. Hey, Will. Monica. Monica, hey. Thanks for stopping by. Yeah. Over here hanging out. Yes. Over here hanging out. Oops. Hope it doesn't rain. Good luck, Panther. But we're covered today, so we're Probably good. Probably will rain. Yeah. It'll be good background noise. We're over here in the forest. Hanging out. Hey, Denise. Hey, Madison. You guys are slapping on these live video likes because I have yet to have to wear a pair of ears in these. And That's honestly, true. I'm almost ready to wear a pair because I feel bad. You guys haven't gotten Seriously? 40 likes yet. That's mean. I mean, I mean, I, it's not like I don't like wearing ears. I just don't have too many pairs that I actually like. Hey, Dre. Oh, it's Denise Lee and Madison. Hey, Radicals. Alyssa, all of our people that were like constantly posting and entering. Blowing my giveaway. phone up. Thank you for that. It was no, pretty awesome. It was, fine. it was pretty awesome. It was awesome. Not gonna lie. Was not expecting this level of uh interest, interaction, love. I guess interaction is the word I'm looking for. Interaction. Yeah. Yeah. Hey Melinda. Wait, Melinda was another one that commented a lot. Oh yeah? Yes. Obviously I put it together. I put all your names together in a spreadsheet. Yeah. Because you know I'm spreadsheety. I'm like organized and whatnot. So well, you're welcome. You, you were randomized in a spreadsheet and yes. then you were given a number for At each random, entry. Obviously, yeah. And then I put that number, because it's easier to do numbers, in a randomizer. And that number is going to be the person that wins today. No, yeah, it's much better than my idea. I was just going to drop numbers into a paper bag. But then it's like. Where are we going to bring a paper bag? We're at Universal. I was going to fold up and put it in the camera bag and then just pop it out and just be like, shake, shake, shake. Yeah. That's a waste of trees. It would have been a recycled paper bag. <laughs> it's a waste of trees. I mean, I could have saved it and taped it together later and used it as TP, I guess. No? Not a good idea? Hey, Sarah. Tried meatloaf at. Liberty Street Tavern a few weeks ago. Thanks for review. Loved it. Oh, oh yeah. Well, we're glad that you loved it. We have I'm glad that's still there right now. We haven't been since the reopening yes. to Liberty Tree. If there's anything that you come across you want to try, yeah. we'll let us know. Most of the recommendations, especially nowadays, come from you guys. We're just hitting stuff at random at this point. Ah, uh, Universal's one of your ears were. Yeah. I can't ears here. I probably could ears. It's probably good. You did wore you wore what? I wore like a little Sailor Moon headband yeah. last time we were here. We got bows. We have other things we could wear here. I do have a Beetlejuice bow to go with this Beetlejuice dress, but it kind of got like a little wonky, um, like a little emblem on it. So I, instead of like chancing losing the emblem on a ride or something, I just didn't wear it. Yeah, and they have like the Hello Kitty ears here and the Shrek ears. Oh yeah, mm -hmm. I did get a pair of Jaws. You have a Jaws, a Jaws headband. Jaws like headband mm -hmm. that I got here that I really want to wear. See the dress Jaws for it. Dress. Mm -hmm. No fancy cocktails today. No, unfortunately, Where Universal is not it's like fancy. Disney. We only have beer as a selection over here today. Otherwise, I'd be too deep in a margarita already. I got um, a Miller Lite because I didn't. Limited edition. I didn't feel like drinking grass clippings. That is Heineken. You like Heineken. Fosters too. So it's much so hate and disrespect. Heineken is a perfectly decent beer. I have no problem with um, disrespect. Grass clippings. I I rather enjoy disrespect. Heineken. I, you have no problem with disrespect. That's what I heard. Jaws yeah. accessories and clothing. Yeah. Yes. It would be good. I feel like we're due for a Jaws marathon. Do we, we do one on Fourth of July this year? Maybe not. I don't remember. 
Watch the first one. I think watch the rest. So what's everybody doing? Everybody keeping up with the news? Everybody excited about everything going on? What news? News. Disney news. Rumors of the fireworks coming back soon. There's oh, yeah. um, all the Halloween merch that's been dropping this oh, week. Oh, you guys, I just spent so much money on Shop Disney the other day. There was like a huge main attraction um, drop. Yes. So I was able to buy every pair of ears that I'm missing from my collection. Um, I just have to hope that my post office actually sends it to me since my first box has already been returned. We are definitely getting Mulan, but we're getting Mulan for eight people? Yeah, we're going to do a, like a little mini Mulan watch party. We're going to vlog it for yes. you guys. You're going to see it. There'll be a video. I did get the candy ears, the Halloween candy ears. I did not buy them online, but they do have them here at, in the parks. Yes. So I got them today, actually. We got that. We got a, what, uh, we got a villain's blanket. Yeah, I got a villain's blanket. Uh, they have... I need a blanket. Limited edition child magic bands out right now. Oh, do they? For the Halloween one? Hmm. I saw the, the orange brick one. The ones we bought? The child magic band? Oh, the child. That child. <laughs> yeah, I thought that you meant child. like children's No, magic there's bands. only one child I care about right now, okay? The child. The child. Forgot about the child. Mm. The child, uh, actually like the child magic band because it's purple. It's my favorite killer. So thanks for subscribing, Frank. We're yeah. glad you enjoyed the videos. Hang out and get to know. We have a good community here, but it's nice. They make food recommendations. We eat a lot. We do. You might not want to watch our videos if you're hungry. Yes. Warning, do not watch our videos if you're hungry. If you do, we have more. What do you think of the Halloween Crocs? We don't croc. We don't croc. Sorry. The, the pattern on them are somewhat cute. Like, I think they have them in leggings, too. My my, my feet will not fit in Crocs. I have boat size feet. They're, like, too. this big. And the princess feet are, like this big yeah and we don't do crocs they don't they don't work for us it's at all true. i've never even been able to get the front of my foot in the crocs i have like one pair of crocs that i got the only pair of crocs i've ever purchased and they are like flip-flop crocs so that i can wear them in the florida rain and like and they massage my feet are they comfortable because they don't seem they're comfortable. very comfortable they got a little heel to them too so i can still be princess seems like you're wearing tupperware on your feet it's not tupperware it's just No, we have not seen the mini green emerald. Well, we've seen this. them online, but we haven't seen them in person yet. We're They're gonna, on the list. We're going to hit up Disney Springs after this yes. for a merch run. So if, I'm hoping the emerald ears. Another merch run. Somebody is going shop crazy this week. I can't. The Disney finally wants to take my money. How much have you spent on? To, how much money have you given Disney in the last 72 hours? Do you really want me to say that? Why not? I'm sure they can do the math on their own when they see them. Probably like $500. To start. She's not done yet. I, I also booked a cabin. So I'll find out about that later. <laughs> Small hand. Coming soon. Um, isn't, that, isn't that it? Did I buy anything else? I thought I just bought 11 pairs of ears. 11. One guy. Yeah. Some people don't buy 11 pairs of ears in a lifetime. And then I bought the ears today. And so the that's another and I'm gonna try and get 60 more bucks. Ears this afternoon. So is that, is that included and in the 500 that's all okay. part of the Did you guys ever see the new crepe stand? We are, are going, going there to today. that way yes. today. It'll going be there. a video sometime in the future. So yes, we. I'm really excited. No, we don't know where we're posting, but we're definitely getting those crepes. It should be soon. Today. I would say probably in the next week or two to post. Behind the scenes secret, most of our videos do not post. 500, but a priceless amount of magic. See, I, Melissa and I were like on the same level. I can't argue with Melissa, so <laughs> I will just bow out of this one. Thank you, Melissa. Can't wait for the review. I can't wait to try it. I'm super stoked. I don't even know that I've ever had a crepe before. Really? When would I have had a crepe? Um, I guess that's a question. Never, I, don't, I don't think I've ever had a crepe. Yes, she has been saving since quarantine. This I spent is no this money. is money that was already planned to be spent, just not all at once. That's true. <laughs> I did plan on buying each one of these ears as they were released. I knew Halloween merch was going to come out. I did save accordingly for that. So right. it's it not was like planned. I was like, oh my god, let me drain my entire paycheck and not be able to pay my regular bills. 
No, this was money I already had set aside. Thankfully, otherwise, I don't know what I would have done myself. I wouldn't have bought the ears. And then I would you have still would have bought them. You still would have bought them. If I have to pick between my bills and ears, I'm gonna pick my bills. Let's be real. Not that ears. Luckily, we don't pick. Have you watching ads? No, this is our chat. No, oh, wait, why are you watching that? that it is a splash in the ocean. Exactly. Mm. Exactly. Do we get some love from NYC? Yes. Oh, we love New York City. We, we can't do. wait to go back. We can't wait to go back and do some videos there. We actually tried to start this YouTube channel in New York City for one of our last uh, last trip there, That's only true. trip there actually. But uh, we <laughs> that was when we were just starting out. We didn't have a microphone. Camera wasn't weather sealed. So like the lens kept fogging up, like we didn't know what we were doing. And we were just trying to take photos. Yeah, we were we were having too much fun. Yeah, honestly. we didn't start our channel until like six months after that. After, after we'd we already research, gone like yeah. gone to three different places, four different places, and yeah. we're like, all right, I guess maybe we should do it. Yeah, yeah let's start a let's thing. start a travel YouTube channel after we travel. After we did all the traveling, and then we haven't gone anywhere since. We went to, we went to New York City and California all within a month. And then Vegas. And then Vegas. And then didn't film any of it. <laughs> Yeah. And then, well, we're going to New Orleans twice on the channel and Tampa. We definitely plan another trip at some point to New York City, and I promise you, yes, we will. We will be doing food reviews. We ate yes. like absolute pigs oh last time we went to New York, <laughs> and we so loved. It. We didn't want to leave. The food was so good. All the vegan cream cheese yes. at all the bagel shops was like a dream come true. Which is like something you can't get here, yeah. and then. All the nerd thing we went to like almost every museum, we every went. comic book store. We went to the Statue of Liberty. We only stayed in Manhattan, unfortunately. We need to go to some of the other boroughs. Fifty-seven percent. It's eighty percent humidity here. Fifty-seven percent would be a gift. Right now we have a breeze, which is nice. But usually, like I would say, 20, 30 minutes ago, I was like sweating for profusely, perspiring like a fountain. Can't wait for you to visit. It's, it's oh, we're definitely going to be some time, though, since you know, obviously, we're all of on. our trips. We had like two trips planned this year mm -hmm. and then two next year, mm -hmm. and that's four next year. Plus, we want to go to New York, so that's a lot of trips. Yeah, everything's later right now. I don't have that much vacation time at work, so mm -hmm. we'll have to space it out a little more over the over a few years. New York, New York might be a weekend trip. I, I would do that. I don't know if it's going to be like a, a week like it was before. Be I would week. like to go for, even going for a week, you can't, you can't do enough. That's why we never left Manhattan. There wasn't enough time to go anywhere else. What comic books do you like? I'm more of a graphic novel person than a comic book person. My favorite series is probably the Sandman series. It's, like it's hard because like, the one that has my heart is probably Sonic the Hedgehog, but I haven't read that in years. But then, like, too. then X Men, manga. and we read a lot of manga. We, we read a lot. A lot of manga. You guys Beko should visit the, the Caribbean. We'd love to visit the Caribbean. It might be too hot for you. <laughs> Can I sing like pirate songs? Yes. Hold on. That would be fun. We we definitely have. We love to travel. We so do. there's definitely going to be more. It's not just Disney. We like to travel. Yeah. <laughs> Happen to go to Disney a lot because mm. we're close to. It. If you go back through our channel, you guys will see videos from Tampa. We have a whole series from New Orleans, which we love and frequent. Um, and I think in the future, so we're thinking about Atlanta. There'll definitely Possibly. be something in the Keys. Probably not this year, but maybe the year, year after. We're planning New maybe York. We'll we're planning Washington. We're planning to go all over the place. It's just a matter of when we, when we do it. We'll travel, we'll go, we'll go everywhere. And then of course we want to go to all the parts around the world too. So we got lots of- Our, our current life situation is gonna put everything on hold, just like for everybody else. Yeah. All of our trips got canceled. We, we were supposed to be getting ready for a trip this week. Yeah. But here we are. Here we are, hanging out with you guys. Are you guys Buccaneers fans? I don't uh, sports. Yeah, we don't watch football. Sports That's football, right? Buccaneers? So. Tampa? All yeah, all football. It's football, yeah. Yeah, yeah we, we don't we watch football. Yeah, super horrible. Yeah, we're we, 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 we watch esports sports occasionally really. when there's like nothing else on. I watch like the Nintendo tournaments right before E3. I watch Evo, but I don't follow any of the players. So I, I, I don't know who's fighting. I'm just entertaining for like 15 minutes. Overwatch League. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's, that's not, not my no. jam. Get on that direct flight. Yes, please. Okay.
We would not hesitate. Uh, would it be okay for a vegan? Like, let's be able to do vegan food. I guess that's research we need to do. Yeah. <laughs> it was easier in New Orleans than we thought it would be. Yeah, that's true. They had, like, legit restaurants in New Orleans. I wasn't expecting that. I thought it was going to be all, like, fried gator and stuff. But no. Beignets are not vegan, though. They're vegetarian. No. Yes, Atlanta's on the list. I'm actually from Atlanta, Monica. I grew up around Grant Park area and went to, went to elementary school in Atlanta. So that's definitely a trip home is uh, planned at some point. We've been to Atlanta once and it was at the end of Shark Week because I like to watch Shark Week and then go to an aquarium at the end of the week. And that year it was the Georgia Aquarium. Yep. And you I love loved it. You couldn't get you to leave the whale room. I love whale sharks. They're like some of my favorites. I just sat. We literally had to drag her out of the room. She didn't want to go. <laughs> I love the whale shark. It made me so sad. It was a huge tank, but it was still sad. We, we did a day trip to Atlanta. We drove up there yeah. in the middle of the night, went to the new bay, and then turned around and we were right back yeah, home. It was probably like, we were probably in Atlanta for maybe 10 hours. If that. If that. Yeah. The Disney Benets aren't vegan. The, the Disney yes. beignets are vegan, the but Disney beignets can be ordered vegan yes. and gluten free. But in in Nola, New Orleans, Nola, you cannot most get vegan we didn't beignets. find a single vegan beignet yeah. the entire time we were there. They use, We've been twice. Um, can sweeten condensed milk in their beignets, in New Orleans. So we, yeah. So where else do we want to go? What, do we, what else do we have on this? Paris, Tokyo, Shanghai. Are we pretending that we want to go to? I'm so happy you bought all the ears you wanted, Princess Monica. I was like, I was ready to quit. I was so, I'm, I've been, this is the most emotional roller coaster that Disney has ever subjected me to, its main attraction collection, and I, I, I want to get off. But then every time I try to get off, they keep me on. She was done. It's it's ever, the after the last ordeal we had with buying those ears, she's like, I'm done. Like, I'm not buying a gouger, I'm not getting the ears that I want. It's just, I'm not getting selected for the lottery. And they dropped the line and she and bought the line. And then they dropped the line, yeah. I'm like, oh, okay, fine. I but, guess I'm buying you, everything. You still need the magic bands, though. Yeah, I was not able to snag the magic bands because I was too click, click, click on the ears. So much so that I paid for shipping when I didn't have to because I just wanted to order to complete. So they get the Tower of Terror ears. Funny story, we went to Hollywood. Tower Terror ears were, Lounge um, Flight ears were released and they were sold out. A week later we went to Animal Kingdom and they restocked them on that day. So if we had flopped our reservations, I would have been able to get the ears. Luckily I had a friend that was there and she picked me up a pair and I think I'm going to meet up with her today and get those from her. Thankfully. Because they keep random dropping them on Shop Disney. And yes. <gasps> too much. It's too... Getting her anxiety up with all this It's too things. emotional. Yeah, it's, it's very... Um, this one asked me to set an alarm stressful. at 3 a.m. just to yeah. catch the first I, I had to make him wait. I had to make him stay up until 3 in the morning every morning because I wake up, I work at 7 a.m. on my, my actual job. So I can't stay up that late, but he can because we work opposite schedules. And so he stays up and tries to find my, my main magic attraction bands, yeah. merch, magic bands. At 3 a.m. Mm -hmm. Long story short, yes, I did get the Tower of Terror ears. It's not in hand. There's a whole strategy involved to get the, the Disney merch you want. Yes, it's, it's almost as bad as this vacation. You line. have to learn that, though. When this whole like quarantine situation started, I had never purchased ears on Shop Disney before, and I've had to learn the hard way. About all this stuff and like try to get me methods of communication by social media so I can keep up with some of this stuff. It's like yeah, Facebook insane. groups help because yes. you usually get notified there before you're notified anywhere else. Or but at the same time, me, which is awesome. as much as we love Disney, their website's trash. <laughs> it's just awful. The fact that you have to rely on third-party sellers, gougers, and Facebook groups to be able to know when what's going on. On Shop Disney is kind of an issue, I feel. Yeah. Enough about Disney, though. We're Universal. Oh, yeah, we are Universal. They're uh, the new um, 
Jurassic Park Velocicoaster, quote unquote, unannounced. Looking good. Mostly done. We're working on some rock work right now. Crane's going. I am surprised it does not look like Universal has bad net gators yet. No, we have seen quite a few people with net gators. If they have, they're certainly not enforcing it. I gave up on trying to get the limited merch when they started releasing the Epcot posters with no warning. Ugh, I know. The, the random drops are the worst. It does look amazing. Does it involve kidnapping Mickey? Mickey. I, I think that Mickey would ban me if I tried to kidnap him, so I'm mm. uh, going to leave him alone. The boss man is, is a, a, an angry rat. Yeah. Uh, the crowd today in Island of Adventure has been pretty good. It's been off and on. We see like patches of people, but for the most part, even over in Hogsmeade today, it was not that busy. It was still, it was Hogsmeade still has issues. It's, it's not yeah. perfect. It's still yeah. kind of like people don't sort of look Speakly. where they're going and they're crossing over and bumping into you. And they, they figured out like the, the, the train station issue, but the rest of Hogsmeade still a problem. Hogwarts Express. Still a problem. Okay. The poor Osprey. Yes. I think, I, I took a picture earlier, I think he's back up there, actually. Yes, yes, I believe I saw him. I couldn't be trying to get closer. When we leave here, I will look, but I think that he's back up there. That Osprey is not going he away. He just wants a perch. Who is it's, it's, Nick Gators aren't down there. Nope, they are no, not. No. Can't wait till the Jurassic Coaster is done. It looks amazing. Yeah, they are they're moving really along. They're, it's like, it's completing faster than Tron, that's for sure. Yeah. It's like light speed. Every time we come over here, there's like drastic improvement yeah, yeah, on how much together. Like last it's time we true. came over here, they weren't, they had just started like putting the frame up for the rock work. Now they have like the rock work up, part of the fences down. They got like a watchtower over here. Like, oh yeah, the little Jurassic Park watchtower. Yeah, they're, they're moving at light speed. I wish Disney could start stuff this quickly. Yeah, right. Most of that would already be done. <laughs> Instead of delayed slash canceled slash whatever most of that guy is right now. It's COVID times. It is. Is that the, the Davin? Davin? Yeah, the Davin. Davin. Hey, Papa Davin. How are you, sir? <laughs> How is the family? Do you guys feel safe in the parks? Yes. Yes. It's not perfect. No place is right now. Um, safer than the grocery store. Yes. You, you sort of define your own level of safety. You be as safe as you can. But I definitely feel a lot safer Disney or Universal than I do in our hometown and in your regular store. Gas stations are a particular issue for me because they yeah, are gas dirty. Are not, They're very dirty. Not a fun place to stop at during the COVID times. No. And they don't care who walks in. They're not. They're not giving people shit about masks. Here, they see somebody, they'll say something. Yeah. They're like a gas station. Somebody walks in with no mask on. Nobody cares. Nobody they don't says care. anything. And this is first to ride the JP coaster. Take that, evil. Papa Dad. Papa Dad says they're great. <laughs> yeah, that bird's not leaving. It, it, it is. They're going to keep moving that net. It's going to keep coming back until that coaster is done. See, so what else do we have on, on the list of things to do? We want to stop by the tribute store. Oh, yeah, they expanded the tribute store here. Area, we want to see that. Yes, there's a, like a new little vegan y item there, too. In the so, list, we're gonna yeah, try and hit that up if we can. I mean, they have like a, some non vegan, like beating heart thingies that I want to see. Really, yes, okay. They like cool take them that. off life support and give them to them, they stop beating. Oh, really? Yeah, That's cute. That. Sounds kind of cool. Jess says, Miss you guys, hope to see you soon. Gotta take my little one to Disney World. Yes, yes. you do. Yes, you and then come here to Universal also. Yes. Mm -hmm. It's fun to see Jurassic Park. Yeah. I'm, all, I'm looking forward to the Nintendo add-ons at Universal. Yes. Those have been postponed. The late postponed. Postponed. Yeah. I'm excited for that. I also want the Classic Monsters area. I like the Classic Monsters. So that'll be cool. And I guess potentially the Fantastic Beasts area. Yes, potentially. They're ready, but... Ready for, for new stuff. I feel like the whole world is, uh... 
is on life support right now, basically. Oh, maybe? I don't know. Oh, a little bit. A little bit of time. I mean, better than the rest, but the rest of the world is doing better than we are. So. Our, our numbers aren't spiking through the roof. So I feel somewhat better about that, but they're still higher than I thought. We're not in Texas. Oh, yeah, though. Somebody's worried about this. I'm a, I'm a real born and bred Floridian. I don't care about hurricanes. Not a cat one, that's for sure. We have reservations for December at Disney. Our borders are still closed, so we may have to postpone. That's why we've had to, de to delay a lot of our traveling, too, yes. because we, we can't go anywhere. We, we had planned the last half of this year to be focused around an international trip, but the borders of that country is throwing Captain Americans. So we are SOL out of that one for a yeah. little bit. We even Usually. delayed it, and even... Even How we the delayed, delayed time not looking line, so great. yeah, it's not going to look good. In fact, she actually said we should wait till 2022, yes. 2023. Our friend Evelyn, you guys have seen in the Evie. in our videos back in November. Yeah, she was in some of our videos for Gapper Day. And was actually November. visiting from Japan. She yeah. advised us not to come right yeah. now. So we we uh, trusted her expertise, and we'll, we'll be delaying that trip yes. as well. Like American passport is really not good for a whole lot right now. So they got three hundred dollar paperweight, two hundred dollar paperweight. It's like a hundred dollars for a passport. It's not expensive. One day. Crazy. Expensive. One day. All what I can new say. Epcot are you, what new Epcot attraction are you most excited for? Probably the Guardians coaster. Is that the Moana walk? Guardians coaster. The Guardians. Gardens of the Galaxy Cosmic oh, Rewind. Guardians of the Galaxy. I thought you said Gardens. I'm Moana. excited for the Moana one, even though it's not a ride. Because that's coming sooner, I think, than Guardians of the Galaxy. Ratatouille will probably be the soonest. It's just, it, it should be almost done. They took down the sign. Mm. They put up the sign, they took down the sign. I don't really think that means a whole lot. That courtyard is almost finished. We'll see. We'll see. I do, I am excited for the Ratatouille ride. Though. Yes. That'll be fun. So, I suppose, should we, um... Is it time? I don't know. Is Has it time, time come for the giveaway? Is it? Okay. What do you guys think? Do you want to give away now, or do you want to wait some more minutes? <laughs> it's their giveaway. We're just the executors of said giveaway. What was your first computer console? Did you have a game you loved and that you're obsessed with? Oh, my. That's a big one. I love Duck Hunt. I played a lot of Duck Hunt when I was on the NES, um, but I also was obsessed with Doom on the PC, okay. like obsessed, yeah. and um, oh, Prince of Persia, Prince of Persia was like, my first yes. console, well I had my first gaming console before we ever had a PC. I was I was PC Master Race for a long time. I'm, I'm dating myself, as I normally do when we have these discussions, but my first console was an Atari. But probably my favorite game as a kid was Mega Man. I think I, I eventually evolved into Mega Man when I got a PlayStation 1. But I started with the original Nintendo and PC, and then, like, I got every console up but until now. I am today, PS4. Who's, who, who's in line for a PS5? <laughs> we are. I mean, we're definitely buying it. We know. We're probably buying two. My first console was the SNES. Dang. Hey, Carrie Ann. Hey, I listen to some of my YouTube videos in the car like a, like a podcast. We miss you, Carrie Ann. Can't wait to see you. Yes. We, we are old o OG gamers. Wait, build up the suspense. <laughs> I played a lot of Duke Nukem and Doom 2 on PC back. Okay, I, I did play a lot of Duke Nukem 2. Either side of an Xbox. <laughs> Well, I mean, I had, you had a you had a 360, and a 360. Didn't you? Yeah, I stopped I getting Xbox One, but PC was my thing. Like I played, shoot, I, I played every. I had games on floppy. Like I started Oregon Trail, this Apple Two, I think it was. Or I whatever. played Oregon Trail Green in screen, kindergarten. Something. Yeah. Yeah, I think it was. I think probably it was like first grade. I don't remember. And I probably owned every Nintendo handheld console they've ever made. Like every single last one of them. 
No, I've never had a Game Boy. I've had, up. I had, but I had like all the other almost two mini games. things, like the little games that Disney would release. It was like the Aladdin game, like making a little game, like whatever. Tiger Beat. Yeah, 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 I, I used to have all those. I still love those. Okay, so Miles Morales PS5. That's definitely going to be Ooh, a buy. Is that a thing? Huh? Yes. Built off the tech from the Spider-Man game that we have for PS4. Hey, it's Bree. Hey, Bree. Thanks for stopping by. Miss Queen of Cancel. We appreciate you <laughs> penciling us in. So she, she knows it's love. She didn't cancel us. Yet. <laughs> Were you more into platform games or first-person shooters? I I was a puzzler and an RTS person. Like I played a lot of King's Quest. Love me some King's Quest. Warren's Passage, just like super weird. Uh, Zamp game. I played Carmen Sandiego. Anthony. Oh, I loved Carmen Sandiego. Yeah. Uh, I was more an RPG gamer. The, the, the second I got my first hand on Final Fantasy and Final Fantasy Adventure, which was actually Mana on Game Boy. Secret of Mana? Yeah. Or not Secret of Mana. The, yeah, okay, I know what you're talking about. I played those on my Game Boy religiously on the six hour drives back and forth from Florida to Atlanta every summer I would be playing Final Fantasy, like Mystic Quest and Final Fantasy. And the commands to play the game. Oh, I love that game. I thought that the art style was so like cool. Like the game. We're huge nerds. So like Command and Conquer Red Alert was like one of my favorite okay. RTS of all time. Oh, yes, and everything's the art I would release as a kid. I was like, can I buy that? Can I buy it? Can I buy it? Can I buy it? Don't bring out a pitchfork, but I have never played StarCraft. Ever. I played. Needs for the win. I have played a lot, a lot of Command and Conquer. Absolutely. What else? So many games. Oh, Sim Ant. I love friggin' Sim Ant. It's so good. I was one of those kids that when you got to Christmas, couldn't get a, I couldn't negotiate for Super Nintendo, so I got a Genesis. So after the NES, I, I branched off, and it was just all Sonic the Hedgehog and like Super Ghost and Ghouls and. Okay, that's cool. Well, I think, I think Will is going to um, force you to play StarCraft. He wants to send you a key. <laughs> I just. The Princess has always been the the bigger PC gamer. When I wanted to play PC games as a kid, I didn't get to play games. The first PC game that I actually owned was Star Wars Galaxy. And that was in like Dang. high school. Bye, Bree. Good luck moving. I can't believe you stopped by while you're moving. Like, yes. Who does that? Well, she stops in the sale. She's a real friend. A real friend. Dedication and love. Have fun moving. Don't drop anything on your toes. May the force be with you. Buy beer and pizza. Ooh. Yes, you gotta have beer and pizza when you move. It's a very important life, life skill. Wings and pizza. Yeah, I, I saw three of them. No, no wings. Yeah. Or maybe we should get. Well, what are we gonna do for this Mulan thing? Are we doing? Pizza and wings? Uh, Shouldn't we do something you know, like period specific? Yeah, I think I want to hey, do Nicole. something like, I'll do a themed meal, I feel. I'm going to cook. So, oh, roller coaster Tycoon. That's our game. That's my game. game. I played so much roller coaster Tycoon. Nicole, I hope you're not working. I hope you were like completely logged out and not working. Nicole, why would you be working? Because we're in the middle of an upgrade. She's probably working. Oh. At least she's got some good um, streaming to watch while she's working. Watch us drink and goof off. <laughs> I mean... Whatever works. Isn't that what she would do? She is on the call this weekend. I thought so. Boo. Yeah, let me some Roller Coaster Tycoon. And Zoo Tycoon. Roller Coaster Tycoon with all the expansions. I never had any of those. Princess, could you tell us what you're going to cook in advance of Mulan and we can try it too? I haven't decided yet, but I definitely want to do. Oh my gosh, oh, thanks, Evan. Oh, one up. We appreciate you. Good, Nicole. Drink with us. I think I want to do some sort of like. Glad you're drinking with us. Maybe like a. I thought wings would be fun. We have a grill, so 
So I want to like grill, but I want to do maybe like fake wings. Like a vegan wing grill? Vegan wings or maybe I'll make my own bur burger patties. I could do the spicy black bean burger patties. Those are pretty good. I can like decorate them to look like Mulan in some fashion. Honestly, we should do battles. It'd be too difficult in the hotel room. Uh, I could maybe try idea with house. chopsticks and popcorn. No, my idea was, I mean, our our place is going to have like a full kitchen and stuff, but we also have the grill. So I figured yes. what we do, especially since that day is, a, is the day that we're traveling down. So I can do all my prep at home. I'm going to prep actual meat too for my meeting friends. I'm going to have to hang touch it yes. and have it marinate overnight or something and then bring it put it in the fridge and then I, I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do yet. We gotta but plan that. When I get there, I will post what we're photos eating, photos, and when I... recipes if I write them. Like we normally do. Most of our most of the time, if we cook or make a food video, it's going to have uh, the recipe in the description. Well, like the July Fourth video we did. Oh. Please. Thank you. We love doing those. We don't like to go out on July Fourth, so usually we'll stay at home and do a video, even before YouTube. We, we would stay at home and watch Jaws all day on July 4th. We don't like getting out. We found an avant-garde vegan on YouTube. I think you'd like him. Great wings recipes. Ooh. Okay. I'm down for that. Vegan. I'm down for that. Which is better, impossible or beyond? Impossible. Impossible. Easily. We actually... Do we? You did. I did not. Yes. Here recently. It, it was not vegan. It was vegetarian. Yeah, we used to not do a video of that, but uh, Starbucks has an impossible... Uh, sausage sandwich, but it's it's vegetarian. It's got like egg and cheese on it. Yes. Will we do a PS5 unboxing? I mean, if you guys want it, we'll do it. Let's we'll get off our back. It's not Disney. Yeah, but we'll definitely do one. We're planning to order two. So. We'll each have one. Uh, Are there other accounts you have I should follow to keep up with the adventures? Uh, we have. Um, just the other social media platforms. We don't have any other YouTube channels. No, we just have the, one. the Facebook, Princess and the Bear Facebook, Princess and the Bear Twitter, Princess and the Bear Instagram. He has Instagram, I have Instagram. I almost Twitter. never post to my Instagram, but it's still there. I do. I post uh, all the food on my Instagram. Yeah, from our Instagram to the, the YouTube channel. The Twitter is just basically me acting a fool 24 7. Basically. I don't know why anybody follows us on Twitter. Yeah, it's just. It's, it's he, so that you can live tweet MC or you watch. Yes. That's what it's for. You're never. That's, I, have, I have issues. It's, I'm triggered now. <laughs> she just broke me. In the beginning, if you guys have followed us from like day one, when we first started Twitter, I did a month-long MCU rewatch before Endgame came out. Love you. 40 followers. I think they probably all have been muted now. <laughs> um, we're going to try to veganize the Edison's Electrifies tomorrow. I'll let you know how that turns out. Yeah, I definitely want to know about that one. So oh, tell me about that. Ooh, $30 for Mulan yet. <laughs> um, I have not been able to tag you because YouTube is being weird, but I did start adding the prices of the, the dishes in the description box so you can like check those out. And we'll start talking more about value, maybe we not try. cost. You, you, you decide what's too expensive for you. We don't, we're not going to tell you to spend your money, but we'll, we'll, we'll talk, discuss how we feel about value of food, but we're probably not going to remember to discuss the prices that we eat. I mean, the, the prices do change too, but I think that was a really great point. We should at least say how much each dish is. Yeah. But anyway, yes, I want to know about the vegan food and $30 for Mulan. Is a deal. He thinks it's steal. a deal. I feel like it's sort of price. Like you have to do a, a watch party like we're doing. Our watch party is not a, a huge gathering. It's only like eight-ish well, people. Well, it's, it's a Disney Max. movie. It'll be six, actually. If we went to a movie theater, the tickets would be 15 to 17 dollars. Per person. Per person. And, and I'd probably want like snacks and drinks. Before and during. Yes. A, a movie outing for us is a good $200 adventure. 100. Depending where we eat before. That's true. Would you go out and eat? 30 bucks. And then I still want snacks. To stay in my own house during all of this. And I can cook. Is a deal. I'm not going to, I will pay $30 for every Disney movie that drops on Disney Plus. New release, obviously, from now until this is all over. 
without complaint. Plus, Mulan at home means wine. This yes. is true. Ooh, 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 they gave me an idea. Oh boy. What if we make like some lotus flower mixed drink and serve that? Do we still have those floating flowers from Rivers of Light? Yes. Of course, we have a full drawer of those stupid ice cubes that I mean, you love. We could do that. Huh? I don't know. I'm gonna try and be fancy, but I'm really not gonna be fancy. Yes, Betty, math does dictate that $30 is an absolute steal. Without. You guys go out all out for a movie. I'm sorry, Devin, but I, I gotta be fat when I go to the movie theater. If, especially if they got vegan noms, because then I'm gonna, I'm gonna get the vegan chili cheese fries, and I'm gonna get If we go to the movie theater, I'm gonna get a bucket of beer. This isn't just for YouTube. If we go to a place like a movie theater, and they have something new, plant-based, that she hasn't tried. Yeah. Even if she just ate, she's gonna buy it. One hundred percent, she's gonna buy it. It's true. Might as well film it. Yeah. <laughs> so it's weird. Our Burger King here in Ireland and the rest of Europe isn't allowed to use Impossible Meat, so they use a product from Holland that they call the Rebel Burger. What? No Impossible Meat. Rebel Whopper. Interesting. Interesting. Thoughts on theaters showing 80s movies. I just saw Back to the Future in theaters and it was so awesome. Hoping to see Raiders of the Lost Ark. We so love much, yes. We love the idea. Yes, please. We just aren't sure about how we feel about sitting in a movie theater right now. I'd rather do drive through yeah, So we're, we're trying to make time and do one of these drive-in drive things. Yeah. There's 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 different ones gonna be held around Orlando that we're looking at planning if the, our schedule works out right, but we don't know how we feel about sitting inside of a building and watching movie right now. But if, if my favorite place opens and they got all the vegan noms, then we'll probably, we're going. We'll probably risk it. I, I need some of But it's, it's a much smaller place. In my life. It's not a chain. It's like a super small two-screen theater that we love to go to. So. Yes. Food is life. It's true. I just love me. I have a, a very strong relationship with food. And not sure about... Not saying the theaters are bad right now, but I used to work in a movie theater, and from my personal experience, having worked in one for five years, I don't feel safe at the movie theater. <laughs> I mean, all. Daphne is in Boise, so I mean, that's we, much different. We went to the movie theaters in Boise, and they were not good. Really they were yeah. not good. Here it's in not Florida? Like Florida? No, nah, I picked those apart. I'm going. I'm doing a family Mulan doing viewing party not sure about my menu yet either yeah like i really want my menu to be themed i feel he was even sending me like oh let's get little lanterns yeah, lantern and lanterns lights and, and stuff. i was looking at a, i was looking at like outfits and i was going not nuts that we're going to have a huge party it's only going to be like six or eight yeah. people it's going to be I small i suppose we might as well like go all out gonna kill me but nothing is stopping me from seeing villain's head next week nothing no oh, we're, we're not wait, mad we're not it's not next, next week? week yeah next week i thought we had some months no no comes on next week oh well shoot don't, don't get us wrong about it we want to go just knowing that i used to be an amc employee and i was responsible for the cleaning in the theaters i just feel some kind of way so we go to cinema problem solved I actually wonder if World Golf Village is open because I'd go to World Golf. Those seats are clean because they like, they're like that. And then we have one theater to clean? Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Maybe. We'll see. We can talk about mm, it. Need you we, can, we can talk about it. Don't you love the way your shoe sticks to the floor in the movie theaters? <laughs> it is very sticky. It's all that soda getting like spilled. It's people with no home it's training so dumping stuff on the floor when you're no done with it? No home training? No home training? You know, yeah, how many training. small children I watch pour their butter upside down on the floor and smear all around leaving for me to clean up? Uh, yeah, I'm not not happy about that. Thank you. Mm. Be excellent to each other. That's right, right. Gavin. If everybody would do that, we would be doing a lot better right now. Yes. I agree. I'm quoting Wayne's World over I'm top of Wayne's World okay. and villains head don't right. you're not supposed I'm a, to notice that. Why would I not notice that? <laughs> Never thought I'd be spoiled. Seven. Yes, you are spoiled right now. Right? Florida is, well, they're being Florida right now. They're, they're, they're holding tight to their title of the black sheep state of America right now. They will not let that go. Yeah, Boise, Boise is unreal with all the cleanliness. It's just not as many people. No. There, the job sounds like a formative 
life experience. There are, there are a lot of horror stories that are not fit for YouTube. But yes, I would call it one of those formative jo job experiences. I liked part of my job. I didn't like the cleaning part. Being a projectionist is really fun. You can learn a lot about how movies are put together. And everything. All the rest of it was basically garbage. So true about Florida. I'm in the South. Why doesn't why can't Floridians drive in the rain? Huh? I, mean, I don't understand that. The, the the core question is why can't we drive? <laughs> okay, that's true. The rain doesn't really that's improve true. or worsen anything. I've just... seen the craziest like driving skills I've ever seen in my life in Florida. When the people I deal with here are hella conspiracy theorists, all of a sudden though. Oh, that's this whole state. So that's this whole state. Hey, don't you know Florida man, Devin? I had to mute half of my Facebook. The first month it was that this didn't exist. And then it was a conspiracy. I think what was, was someone talk about aliens last week. Oh gosh. <laughs> like, yes. I can't I can't really say what happens to Florida, what happens to Florida is I just can't. Nobody can save them from themselves. So now is it time? Uh, yes, now we can now do it. Now it's time? Now it's time. Now it's time. Oh, hey, just like. You're getting butterbeer. I okay. may have to get some butterbeer. We we're going to head your direction after this. You guys are at Universal. We're at We're hiding Island's in ILA right Adventure, now. In the Jurassic Park area. Yes. Fully. It's covered and there's fans. And... Yes. Yeah. We're not dying in the heat like I was like 10 minutes ago. So, some for, for, for the giveaway. Yes. So, we're going to. So the giveaways been running what, for two weeks now. Yes, we and uh, almost 300 entries. Yes, this is a lot. Hold on. So very difficult to put into like a randomizer. For a pair of the main attraction. Small world leaders. Small world leaders. Yes. All right. So I got my spreadsheet. It's yes. All like numbered and stuff. Yes, you're all on here. Was, how many were there in the end? It was like almost 300. Let's see. And now I got my random number generator and so see it's just a square right so all you have to do is tap anywhere in the square Am I, and you tap it's going to pick a number I, I tap you want to tap it's a lot of responsibility you want me to tap how about i hold it and you tap you have pretty your fingers in there there you go okay okay move 33 okay 33 i'll do 33 for the winner is 33 who, who is 33? 33 is Liz S. Liz S. I don't think Liz S is on here. I don't think she's in our live stream. <laughs> can I, pick, can a I pick a number? Shade. Shade, I don't think you can tap. You're going to tap through the screen? You're going to tap for us? I'm going to highlight. Hey, Black Panther. It's Liz S. from Liz her S. comment on August 4th. So Liz S., please contact us. Yes. And we will work on getting your prize sent out to you. You have a week, you have a week. to contact us. We'll put all this in the community tab. If we do not hear from Liz S. in a week, we'll, we'll be doing we'll another drop. Somebody else. So, that's that. Yay for Small Order. We, I think we are going to try and do some other giveaways. We have a lot of stuff to give away we that I've been slacking on. He's the one that has been saying, see you, Davin. He's the one that has not been wanting to do the giveaways, and I'm the one that's been piling up the stuff. I have not really been wanting to mail things right now, so, but it's been getting better. So Liz S, find us. Find us. The easiest way to contact us will be at our email, which is linked in our About tab. Yes. Uh, that comes with both of our phones, and we will mail it out to you at the, our earliest meetings. Yes. We have seven days. Yes, we'll mail it out probably. Well, we'll mail it out either when we hear it or... Should take time. We're very, we're very close to the post office, so. I was secretly hoping Melissa would win. Were you? I was. I've been she did. I've been asking for Melissa to win all week. USPS is struggling. We oh, do support gosh, them. Yes. I, USPS. I, I visit USPS probably two, three times a month right now. Oh, they're really hurting my feelings with my main attraction ears that they're That's not their fault. trying to. Now I just got a notification that it is going to be delivered. It's messing up. First it said insufficient address. Now it says expected delivery. We've had a real problem we'll getting stuff from not. Shop Disney delivered to the house. Like it just, 
I get I Sometimes get, it works. Sometimes it's like your address is wrong, but our address hasn't changed. Yeah, it's the post office. I honestly feel like the post office just gets lazy and they don't want to mail us or deliver our stuff. Oh, you said unit instead of condo number. number. Or whatever. So is our princess, but not secretly. <laughs> Sorry, um, Melissa. Maybe next time. I'm gonna have to do something special for you. I, but you know, I also had that second thought. Like, can we even mail to you right now? Yeah, there's a lot of places like we have stuff to mail to our friends in Japan, but they're not yeah. even accepting mail from us right yeah. now. Yeah, so. I have a, I have a huge stack of probably like 20 things piled high. It's probably about five feet high right now, four or five feet high. And I'm still buying them stuff. And we can't mail it to them. I'm so jealous, I'll never get to go to Disney. Never oh. say never. Yeah, that's right. I think never say never, just like, never. You putting James Bond right now? I'll show up at your house for them in January. <laughs> Hey. I'm okay with that. At this point, it look, if you were to walk into our living room right now, it looks like we're running a Disney merch store. Even though most of the stuff is hers. Most of the, oh, because I have an ear wall, maybe. Maybe. Uh, we'll see. Ear wall, the magic band wall, the pile of oh, stuff yeah. for Ed and Taylor. It looks like a merch store. I checked and we have probably about 10 magic bands we haven't linked per person, but I checked MDV and I already have about 50 and he already has about 40, so we have five. There have a lot of magic bands. We have a lot of magic bands. That, that, I don't know why we buy so many. There's some that I still haven't even worn that we bought. That's that's like just, that's the linked ones. I'm not even on the ones that aren't linked. No. Ones that we bought that I haven't worn yet. I'm so jealous I'll never get to go to Owen. I'll show you. Okay, wait. I'm reading the same comments. Probably never. Wow. Ha ha ha. Denise, a uh, little kind of something. Thank you, Monica. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for always being you, supportive. Monica. We appreciate you. You have a good Shady, weekend, too. I still want my Bloody Mary review from everywhere. I've been doing some. I got some on Bloody Marys. I don't got a lot, but, you know, they can't veganize every Bloody Mary. There, we can I get try. one. We usually get it. We looked at one this morning, and it wasn't vegan. It was not vegan. That salami and cheese. And cheese in it? Even though I probably could have asked for it without. They still put the Worcestershire. And not every place and carries the Worcestershire. Yeah, either they don't... They they ought to put the meat in worse to sure. It's always been a problem. Are hard. Don't even have that many socks. I love watching <laughs> sport finals. Really socks either. Socks? Like Disney socks? It's just socks. Number of socks to magic bands. Wow. You, def definitely you definitely have, have band more magic socks. bands than you have socks. I did just buy you a pair of socks. A pack of socks. So. Yes. But I think it was only like 10. <laughs> so... Yeah, more magic bands than socks. Costco socks. Same, too. same for me. I don't think you love a socks man either. I wear them to work. Yeah, yeah, it is what it is. I love watching. I support quietly. Well, we appreciate you supporting us, Shady. Yes, we appreciate all of you that support. All your even comments, the ones that don't all your comment. Likes all the um, engagement that yeah. we've had. Just everything we appreciate. All of you if you come by and watch, you don't have to comment. We want you to like if you like it, but if you don't want to, you don't have to. We appreciate that you appreciate the content. We keep making it for you. Only has three pairs of socks with no holes. <laughs> I believe that. I know you need some socks. I mean, that's probably what I got. Probably need to double up on that with birthday and Christmas sock, sock buying, yeah. Maybe we'll have a sock giveaway. A Disney sock giveaway. Princess, have you seen the U.S. monster dresses on Unique Vintage? No, but I need to. I need to know. We know you're always giving up support, Black Panther. Black Panther is everywhere. Instagram, Twitter, videos, popping up all over the place. We hey, love the support. We appreciate, Shady, we appreciate you liking our videos, though, because the like really does help us out, and it does go a long way. Roseanne, I'm the same way. I um, I almost never comment on anybody's videos. And we're on YouTube all on, the time. Stop. There's some, but it's very rare. Mostly we stop this life. Yes, we do stop <laughs> this life. And give them a hard time about doing trying vegan food. <laughs> One day. One day they'll try. Uh, what motivated you to start a channel, and has it been what you expected? Uh, well, the motivation is that we were already doing this already. And we were, you know, we both had social media camps. We were already taking a lot of video and food. And we wanted to get into YouTube 
we have you know all sorts of interests. So. We had our own separate reasons for wanting to do YouTube, yeah. but having discussed that and discussing our skill sets, we were able to kind of like find some common ground and find a niche that worked for us. Yep. Especially because I was going through that period where I was like, I don't think I can eat vegan at Disney. So this this was kind of like our well, let's let's try let's it. Let's see. If we see. Can. He wants to do so. I have the skill set to be able to take us to the finish line, so why not? Why not? Those videos were really hard. It's probably the hardest videos we filmed were at home. Yes, we were not ready to film at home. Those videos, lighting and everything else in our place is not fantastic. You guys know, we complained about it like every live stream. Like, we, it, we're good now. We're finally in a place now where I feel okay. Yeah. But Thank like, you. understand that we bought lights, new microphones. We got the, all the lights in the house changed so they all match the same temperature as the, the camera set to like... Our house is set. Yes. <laughs> it is a lot. You are, you all are one of the first vloggers each and every day we look forward to. That's so sweet. Aww, we appreciate you. you so much. We appreciate your input helping us refine and perfect our channel. We're growing with you guys. We did not know what we were doing in the beginning. We still don't feel like we're doing what we're doing now, but we're, we're figuring out just like you guys are. Y'all did so, with, so well with videos during the demic. They were fun and I love the food porn. Well, we appreciate you. They were a pain in the butt to cook and a pain in the butt to edit, but ultimately I think they were great. Mainly because we were doing that while we were working. Yes. So some of those videos, even like the one I don't know, like six minutes, took like 10 and 12 hours because to film. we had to stop and do meetings for our day jobs and then go back to the cooking videos. Those videos took a long disaster. time. Any international stuff planned Tokyo, Paris? Yes. Yes. Just Eventually. Probably not for a year or so when the pandemic stops. We've talked about it before. We did have a trip planned to go to Tokyo next month. Yeah, actually. That's right. And we had to delay and cancel that. So I finally started an eBay store to get some income. I finally got all my lighting. I see it's very important. Lighting. Well, it's very important. It was one thing that we learned starting a YouTube channel are the, the people will forgive almost anything. You, you don't need to have like a fancy camera. You don't need to have like the best gear, but lighting and sound will drive people nuts. Sound more than anything. More than video, sound will drive people absolutely nuts. It's true. <laughs> Here I am, like I need a reason to spend more on online shopping. Melissa, you and I are like kindred spirits on that, I swear. Please keep doing what you're doing. Your videos simply make me happy, and that's invaluable during this time. Oh, we oh. appreciate it. If we can do only that, we feel like we're doing a good job. Luckily, I don't need sound for pictures. Oh, oh, oh. Melissa, oh my gosh, you didn't have to Thank do that. Thank you, we appreciate, we appreciate that. you. She put that towards the ear fun. No. <laughs> you guys are always, you're always supportive. You're, we love it, we appreciate it. I was born in Key West, Florida. Yes, we, we were talking about going there, but again, COVID times. Yeah, we looked it up recently. And uh, within the last week, yeah, most of the stuff is still closed, yeah, so we don't know. So, there's not really much to do in the Key West right now, but that is also on a list of potential travel spots. But we want to do like a kayaking thing, yes, I so want to go kayaking yes. on this coast. I've only done it on the west coast, so yes, I was born in the Keys. I'm a military family, so I was born in the Keys some, some long, long, long time ago, yeah. San Antonio, come here. Oh. Texas? You want Texas? I mean, uh, it's hot. It is very hot. I don't know. I'd go for the food. I, I hear that Texas has some good vegan food if you go to the right places. I hear they have some subpar barbecue. Subpar? <laughs> oh, those are fight words. We did Hong Kong and Tokyo in November 2019, made it cheaper. Cheaper than going to Asia separately since only one set of flights. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay. We talked about doing that too, but obviously there's no way we're gonna be able to do that right now. No, no, no. It's definitely planned. If we can do the multiple trip, like you did, you did actually discuss when we were trying to plan out. I was like, why don't we just go to Shanghai? <laughs> When they opened, you were like, let's go to yeah, Shanghai. But that was right let's before go. everybody closed on the borders. It's like, nope, you can't come now. Oh, yeah. It was like, oh, if we can't go to Japan, let's go to China. But can't do that either. 
We are here for VA Combat Vet. Austin has one of the most famous barbecue spots. See? Okay. Look at you. Right. Trying to trying to throw some shade. Hey, I have he eaten, does not even know what he's I've talking eaten about. Carolina barbecue. I've eaten Tennessee barbecue, Kentucky barbecue. You've been to Texas. Texas many is a times. lot of fruit, huh? But you went to Dallas though. You went to Dallas, yes. But nobody ever wanted to go out for barbecue in Dallas. Really? Yes. Don't ask me why. And everything else, they wanted to go to Benihana. Nobody wanted to go. Go to I do not know. It was close to where we were working. Okay. Ask Nicole. They didn't go anywhere fun to eat. We went to Nicole one. Should have been driving the we bus. We went to one Mexican restaurant. Nicole should have been driving the bus. Margaritas. That's why she wanted to go because the margaritas are like this big. Yes. <laughs> I'd be all about that. Vegan here is on point. Yes. Yes, I was trying to get in trouble. Yes, I have to come out and try your barbecue. There is a lot of food in Texas I want to try. I don't hate Texans. I have Texas friends. I have friends in San Antonio, actually. Nicole, I heard that I'm not allowed to let you drive, like, ever in any scenario. No. Because bad. it's worse than fearing for my life. Everybody's afraid of Nicole. Everybody, with any sort of sense, is afraid of Nicole. I driving. say bring it on. <laughs> Black BBQ. Okay, I'll put that on the list. Put it on the list for your next Texas trip, whenever that is. Uh, Sometimes no, Bear takes trips without me. The last one he filmed, but we never posted it, so maybe. Because it was Fort Lauderdale and I didn't eat anything, really. Yeah. He ate, he just didn't want a lot. It, it was like bar food. It's fine, it's okay. Alright, well. Oh, so it's about that time? It is. We are gonna go get some more drinks. Yes. We're gonna go to those crepes. Yes. We're probably gonna go to the, the tribute store. Yes. And uh, do some food reviews. Yes. So as, as always, hit the notification bell if you want to get notified of other videos like this. The comments, like these, and our other videos are the place to let us know what you guys want to see. We will always take your suggestions of anything boring that we want to do, and uh, we will see you soon. Sure, subscribe. You heard the girl. <laughs> You're such a weirdo. <laughs>